Well, congratulations. I see you have some chocolate, so you must be feeling good now. Of course. <laughs> is that the first thing you go for after a fight? Chocolate? It's always, it's, uh, it's not about the chocolate, but always food after the fight. 100%. So how are you feeling after that performance? I feel good, actually. Uh, well, I didn't get the chance to finish him, but after one year of not fighting, the performance I put, in my opinion, it was good and, you know, just continue. And that's it. What was the reason for the, the layoff? Uh, I wanted to come back earlier. I tried to, but I don't know what the, what's the reason, but it didn't happen. So I don't know what, what was the holdup, but it is like I tried to fight earlier, like maybe February, even May, but it didn't happen. It just dragged all to September, and I don't know why, but it doesn't matter. So I fought now, all good, next step. Is that the longest layoff you've had in your career so far? Uh, no, I think I had another one. The one I fought in PFL, and then after one year, I fought in UFC. Exactly one year, like the same date. 18 March, 18 March, 2022, 2023. So um, just talk to me a little bit about the fight. Did you anticipate it going the full rounds, or, or what did you expect in there? Well, I tried to finish every fight. Uh, I mean, I tried to go for a knockout. But if it doesn't happen, you know, of course it's gonna go to uh, like uh, for three rounds. So it doesn't matter. I mean, I try to enjoy and have fun and win the fight. You know, but it is what it is. It's all good. Was there any pressure com having coming off a loss? Plus, you have that long layoff. Was there nervous, more extra nervous energy or anything like that? No, uh, I don't care about that actually. But. You know, you wonder like how you're gonna be in Octagon after like you have experience, you lay off, you know, you just kind of lose a little bit of that. I'm not afraid of that, but yes, you know, you have like something where maybe it's gonna go this way, you know, something's gonna interfere, but overall like all good. I don't care about that too much. What about your opponent? What did you think of him? I knew he was aggressive, you know, he has good punches, he has power and everything. Uh, but we will, like, we prepared uh, very well for him. So uh, I wasn't afraid or nervous, whatever. You know, I, I knew what I was doing. Like, we had a plan and it worked. And that's it. And now coming off that one-year layoff, how soon do you want to get back in there? Well, maybe three or four months I can come back. I want to because it's my career. You know, time is running out, so I want to fight more and more. So. Do you have any opponent in mind or a location you'd like to fight at? Uh, or I'm not that type of guy. Whatever they give me, I'm going to fight. I don't care. <laughs> Thank you. Congrats on the win. Solid performance. Yes. Uh, we you. usually get some little jams or some great stories from fighters when they're away so long. What were you able to do in, the, in that time besides, I don't know, rest, recover, reflect, go crazy, wh whatever it is? Work? <laughs> That's what I did, honestly. Like, I just keep training and working and wait for my opportunity to fight. And that's it. Nothing crazy I did. I mean, I was working in the sun all day for... What were you doing exactly? Construction working. Construction building, sorry. And it's very hard. It's not like USA. USA is a woodwork, you can call it. There it's like construction for real. Like all day in the sun, just concrete, metals, everything. That's what I do every day, like, and train too. That's awesome, man. So you stayed in shape. Regardless, of getting ready. How soon were you supposed to get back? You mentioned you wanted, you didn't want it to be a year. When were you supposed to come back? Yeah, so I like uh, the last fight I had is what 22 uh, July it was, right? So you know, recovery was three months, and I got permission from the doctor to come back after three months. So I just add another three months, just you know, to prepare and everything. So I wanted to come back February, but it didn't happen. And I'm a Muslim also, so I fast in Ramadan. It was in March. I'm not going to fight in Ramadan because you cannot train. So after that, I wanted to come back in May. That didn't happen either. So the time they gave me was September. Today. Yes, sir. Well, welcome back. What were you proudest of tonight? Regardless of the layoff, that means nothing now because you gave yes. us a great outing. What, was, what were you happiest with in the 15 minutes that you gave us? Uh, well, it looks like never, nothing changed. Like, I even progressed. The way I see it, even with the layoff, I see, like, progress, you know? So, like you said, doesn't matter I sit or not. If I'm still good and making progress, that's all that matters, you know? Ideally, would you want to turn around and finish this year with one more fight or not just 2025? So, now it's September, right? Until December, how much we have? Three months? 
I mean, uh, I'm not going to say no. If I have the chance, why not? You know, more money, more fights, more experience, everything. So, yeah, if we will have the chance, yeah, why not? Excellent. Congrats on the win. Well done tonight, sir. Welcome back. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.